What's a definition of a mole that most people don't know? That's right, a wall that separates two bodies of water. But just like a mole divides water, a mole divides the number of atoms with their atomic mass and the substance's mass. What does that mean? In chemistry, a mole defines the number of atoms needed for an element's atomic mass to be equal to that weight in grams. In simpler terms, it is a constant that represents a number of items. This number, originally based on the amount of atoms in 12 grams of carbon-12, was determined by Italian physicist Amadeo Avogadro to be 6.022 times 10 to the 23rd, giving it the name Avogadro's number. Because of this number, Mole Day is celebrated on October the 23rd, starting at 6.02 a.m. How do we use a mole? Well, it's not the same as weight. A mole of carbon weighs much less than a mole of lead. Depending on the atomic mass, a mole of a certain element can weigh different amounts in grams. After all, the atomic mass is the average grams per mole of that element. Despite this fact, there is actually a way to use liters to determine moles. At STP, one mole of a gas occupies 22.4 liters of space. Overall, while moles are useful, moles in chemistry are influential because they allow atoms to be quantified.